Stephen Davis, Inside Sales of Avacent. What is the highlight at this Intro 2008? Okay. Uh, it's our central management solution of the data center assets. So we can manage the physical servers and the virtual servers. And also now we can do power control. So we actually can tell you how much power your racks are using in the data center. So uh, I can show that to you if you like. All right. So this is the central management interface. Uh, it's a central point to access all the assets you have in the environment. Uh, I can manage servers, network equipment, uh, VMware ESX servers. So not only do we support absent products, we also support third-party products. So great tool. Um, here you can actually see the power control here. So I'll go to power management, go to the rack. So I can go here to rack two. Power management and reports. So in one quick report here, I can actually tell you let's say energy consumption here. Click on run report and now I can tell you the whole week how many kilowatts I've actually used. So I can actually tie a cost into that. So as a day center um, director, I can actually know how much that rack is costing me at any given time. So for our solution, you're only looking at a base package starting at $24.95 and this power management plugin is uh, just under $5,000. So who can get the benefit from your software? Who are main customers? Any customer that has you know, two or more servers virtually. We have solutions for one server up to thousands of servers. We can go global or test labs. Literally anyone that has IT assets can benefit from our solution. Lastly, can you add a little bit, show us some of the virtualization? You absolutely, have absolutely. So virtualization the benefit of this here is being able to go down here to virtualization. I can actually see my ESX servers, so the actual physical server that these virtual hosts are on. Or I can actually go here to the virtual machine. So I add a click of the button, I see everything that's in my environment. So here's my virtual machine. I can actually launch the VMware viewer. I'll go to this XP box here and launches a new window. So that easy.